Hello, I am Dr. Heather Neal. I am co-founder and CEO of Global Nutritional Healing, and I'm here today with Joy Feldman, also co-founder of, of Global Nutritional Healing. And welcome to all of you. We're so glad you're here today. I'm yes. Let you go, Heather. Tell oh, okay. We're going to start with we just we want to give you a little bit of background on how we found mineral balancing, our, our stories, pretty much. And I started uh, back in 2005, I, I was uh, pregnant with my, my daughter and I had been sick through my whole pregnancy. Uh, actually it was respiratory problems and I had had asthma, you know, most of my life. So I, I went to my doctors and they said, oh, it's because your hormones are changing. And I really didn't think anything of it. And then after I had my daughter, I couldn't even get out of bed. It got to the point where we moved in with my in-laws and my husband had to stop his business to help take care of me. Mm -hmm. And it was quite a humbling experience <laughs> to say the least. And so I ended up, it, it was respiratory problems and uh, they ended up going into pneumonia. It was a fungal pneumonia. And uh, the doctor that figured that out had called me and told me to sit down and said, I had about two months to live and to get my affairs in order and to quit breastfeeding my daughter. And she wasn't even two months old. So when you get a message like that, <laughs> big shocker. So I ended up that I felt sorry for myself for a couple of days. <laughs> and then I started researching and I had family members helping research and I, somebody had found, um, I like testing and somebody found a doctor who did HTMA, which means hair tissue mineral analysis. So I got a hair analysis and started on the program and it was about four months to where it was no longer found on my chest x-ray. And my doctor at that time told me to thank my lucky stars that uh, you know, most people had passed away from that type of pneumonia. Mm -hmm. And so that was my, my starting, I, I mean, I wasn't completely hundred percent. It took, it took years because I was really sick, but to have that, to be told that it was gone, I was, I knew that I was going to be able to, uh, to my dog, my dog agrees. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I knew I was going to be able to take take care of my daughter and and that's exact I, I started a business all kinds of things so that that's a the short version of it so <laughs> of my story so joy would you like to share your story say thank you for sharing that and um, i we share something interesting too because it was after i had my first child where my health fell apart as well and there's my dog who just peed his <laughs> mine was barking. But, oh, your dog must have heard mine. <laughs> oh, yes, <laughs> anyway, yeah, after I had my first child, I wound up pretty crippled from my neck down with some type of immune issue that nobody could figure out. And um, it really was a frightening time. And my husband was a resident at that point. We were living in the Midwest and you know, he couldn't help me. And I used to crawl from my bedroom to my son's nursery on my hands and knees because I couldn't even get upright um, on my own with because of the pain and the swelling in my joints. And I had moved to Arizona. My husband was starting a fellowship in sports medicine at that point. And I figured I had nothing to lose. And I called the school of massage and they sent me a woman who told me about a doctor who was an MD that just did nutrition. And I called him and went and met him. And he was very helpful. He really said, I will, you will be better. And within three months of following the hair tissue mineral analysis, um, dietary protocols, supplements, and lifestyle changes, all of my symptoms went away. It was a miracle. And my rheumatologist said to me, Joy, all your blood work is now normal. Whatever you are doing, continue. So that was in 1992. I had been doing this work 
it's been a really long time. <laughs> wonderful journey. And, you know, one of the things I think that's important for Heather and I to share with all of you as well is to let you know how dedicated we are to this work. I mean, between the two of us, we've been doing this work for about 50 years or more. Yeah. Um, and we really believe in this and we hope that you will take the next step and um, become part of our school. And we look forward to meeting you and working with you. We do. We hope to see you soon. Bye.